the penalty for disobeying this law was being thrown in a den of lions, which like the fiery furnace, was essentially the death penalty. This would have been easy for any believer to work around. Daniel could pray in secret or even in his heart, and no one in government would be the wiser. He could outwardly obey the law of the land while still obeying and praying to his God. However, this is not what he did. Instead of praying in secret or in his heart, Daniel opened his windows and prayed out loud for everyone to hear in open defiance of the law. Again, according to modern interpretations of Romans 13, it would have been the duty of God's people to pray to the king and to cease praying to God. And again, surely Daniel would have received his just reward of death 